What a fall classic, 1968. Detroit and St. Louis went the full seven games. Bob Gibson starred on the NL team. Intimidating, no nonsense of me. Danny McLean was the Tigers stud. He'd win the MVP and Cy Young. Al Kaline headed for the Hall of Fame. Needed a World Series next to his name. Struck out 17, allowed no runs as the cards went up, one game to none. The Tigers came back to even it up behind Mickey Lolich, now it's one to one. Back in Detroit, the cards took the next game with a start from Washburn and a Horner save. Game four, Gibby, a complete game gem. He added a home, he struck out 10, he gave a 3-1 lead to the defending champs. It looked like the Tigers didn't have a chance.